hello guys now we will see string buffer class because in the last tutorial we have seen the concept of mutable string so for getting mutable mutable string you are in the need of special class so for that we have the string buffer class string buffer class create the mutable string string buffer class is same as a string class and it create the mutable string and it cannot be it can be changed okay that is the main difference between string and string buffer so in string buffer we have the three uh, special method you can say constructor here the default constructor empty one so it will create the empty string and its capacity is 16 capacity 16 means we can put there 16 character string buffer string str it means that we can specify initial string value and here in capacity means we have to represent the capacity of string and later on we will add the string there so these are the three methods so here in string buffer we have the append method we are i think aware about that it is used for adding the string there in the existing string so append method concatenate the given argument with the string for example uh, first you have to use your string buffer class with the initial string value and later on you can use append method with the again string value and whatever the string is there that is added at the end so your output is initial string plus this second string that is hello java so in this way we can change the initial string value that you can't do in a simple string class next one is insert method so for using insert first you use string buffer object with the initial value insert one java it means uh, we are going to add java value after the uh, first position it means your output will be like that h java and then l l o so here one means here after zeroth position one onwards you are getting the java string means first as usual you will get h because h will be in zeroth position then from one onwards we are getting java then after that rest of the character will be printed like e double l o next one is string buffer replace method so here i am directly focusing on the program so here in the string buffer our value is hello as usual and we are replacing with the new value so in zeroth position uh, in place of first two character i want the java zero means this h position two means number of character like h and e so in place of h e i want the java so your output will be java and then rest of the llo will come so here first represent the starting index position and here it represent the number of character okay so here the replacement are replace the given string from the specified position so here 0 is the first position and here you can say 2 means number of character that will be replaced so our next one is delete so by name only you can guess the meaning it will delete the string value so here 0 means this position 2 means number of character so here h and e will be removed and that the reason you will get 2 times l l o and then we have the reverse method that you can easily use without having any parameters you simply use and you get the reverse string this is one of the easiest method for using then capacity capacity uh, many people they get confusion here the capacity in the string buffer class return the current capacity of the buffer the default capacity as i told you it is 16 if the number of character increase from the current capacity 16 then the increase capacity is old capacity into 2 plus 2 for example if the current capacity is 16 then it will be changed into 34 so our next capacity is 34 means we are going to add suppose 17th character then it will be you can say it will be near about double plus two extra character will be added like that it is working here i am going to take one program also for you and uh, here 
if you use capacity method the result is 16 because default capacity is 16 now in that string value i am adding hello and now i am checking capacity it will give 16 because we have total 1 2 3 4 5 character if suppose i am adding the more character it will be uh, definitely more than 16 so once again if you use capacity it will be 34 because of this formula 16 into 2 plus 2 it will be 34 our formula is old capacity into 2 plus 4 because we have added more number of character ultimately it is more than 16 and uh, you can say less than uh, less than 32 so this formula will be working out because what, what happened once it is more than 16 then capacity will be changed like that 16 into 2 plus 2 34 once it is again more than 34 then again 34 into 2 plus 2 so like that it is working so here our tutorial is over if you have any doubt you can comment me thank you